Well, I first saw um, Susan Meyer um, in July of 2005. Um, she had had a long history of valvular heart disease that was felt to be due to rheumatic fever. She had had for almost 15 years known problem with her mitral valve, which is one of the four one-way valves in your heart that keep the blood flowing in the right direction. Her other problem was that she had atrial fibrillation and she had about a five to ten, his, ten year history of atrial fibrillation. So by the time I saw her, she had failed and gotten past the point of where medicines can control her symptoms. And at that point with her problems, there was really very little choice but surgery. And for the valve problem which she had, we had planned to replace her mitral valve. For the atrial fibrillation, we were planning on doing a, a maze procedure. And that's an operation that was developed here at Barnes Jewish Hospital and Wash University um, and first performed in 1987. Um, we have done um, this operation longer than any place in the world and have taught virtually all the surgeons around the world how to do the operation. It's very nice to see Ms. Meyer being able to return to her normal life and going back to teaching. And it's a tremendous feeling and that's one of the big reasons uh, you know, you go into surgery is to make people better like that.